Good morning, children. How are you all? Hope you all are doing good. So, children, in this class, we are going to start the new lesson. Okay. Lesson number three our helpers. Okay. Our helpers. So, whom do we call our helpers? So, children, in our daily life, we need many things to do. Is it? It is not possible for us to do everything by ourselves. Is it, children? We can't do all the work by ourselves. Is it? For example, can we build a house? No. And what to go? If the taps are leaking, if a pipe is get repaired, can we do it by ourselves? No, we can't do. Is it? And what to go? The furniture, like the bench, table, all are done by ourselves? No, we don't make it. Is it? And what to go? When we are sick, we go to someone. We call him an emperor. Is it? We don't take medicines by ourselves. Is it children? And can we sweep all our surroundings? Can we do that to keep our surroundings clean? Can we sweep all the area? No, even we don't do that. Is it? So for all these things, we depend upon some, our, some others. We call them as our helpers. Okay, so these helpers make our life easy and comfortable. Okay, so we depend upon these helpers. We call them as their helpers. So a job done by them, okay? A job done by a person to earn money. We call them as its occupation, okay? So these helpers render their service to earn money, okay? So a job done by a person to earn money is his occupation, okay? So like this way, we depend upon many helpers to make our life easy and comfortable. Is it true children? We can't do all the works by ourselves, is it? So we depend upon these helpers, okay? Some of the helpers who makes our life easy and comfortable, okay? So in this lesson, we are going to learn about some of the helpers and how they help us in our daily life, okay? So, before starting the lesson, everyone open your sparrow textbook, 7 textbook. Okay, lesson number 3 are helpers. It's in page number 179. Page number 179. So, before starting the lesson, we will do a lesson reading. Okay, children. So, everyone open your textbook. Okay. So children, open your Sparrow Sem 1 textbook, okay? Sem 1 textbook, lesson number 3, our helpers. So it's in page number 179, okay? Open page number 179. Lesson number 3, our helpers, okay? In our daily life, we find many people who help us. These people do different kinds of work to earn money. A job done by a person to earn money is called his occupation. People of different occupation help others by providing them with their services. Let us know about some people who help us. Okay, so you can find the pictures also here. So, here, I am a tailor. I stitch clothes for you. I am a teacher. I teach you to read and write well. I am a policeman. I catch thieves. I am a postman. I bring letters for you. I am a sweeper. I keep the surrounding clean. I am a doctor. 
I cure sick people. I am a barber. I cut your hair. I am a cobbler. I mend you shoes. I am a plumber. I repair taps and shovels. I am a washerman. I wash your clothes. I am a carpenter. I make furniture for you. I am a grocer. I sell fruits and vegetables. So you can find the pictures also children here. So these are some of the helpers. Okay. Okay. So now I am going to explain the helpers. So who are the helpers? The helpers help us to make our life easy and comfortable. So in this lesson we are going to learn about some of the helpers and how they help us. Okay. So the first one will start by tailor. So how does a tailor help us? A tailor helps us in stitches clothes. Okay. He stitches clothes for us. Is it? We purchase the clothes from a shop and we to who will go and give it to them. So our tailor stitches clothes. Our clothes are stitched by the tailors. The tailor helps us in stitching the clothes. Okay. The next is teacher. So teacher is one who teaches to read and write. When you go to school, is it? When we are in school, who teaches us? Our teacher, is it? Our teacher helps us to read and write, is it? So teacher teaches to read and write. Policeman, policeman catch thieves, okay? Policeman catch thieves. The policeman helps in catching thieves, okay? Postman, what is the postman? How does the postman help us? The postman bring letters, okay? So our relatives who are uh, staying in faraway places, they used to write letters and they post it. So who will bring these letters to us? Yes, the postman brings letters, okay? Postman brings letters. Plumber, how does the plumber help us? Plumber repairs taps and shovel. What does the plumber do? Plumber repairs taps and shovel. When the taps and shovels are repaired in our house. So who do we call? We won't do it by ourselves, is it? So we call a plumber, is it? So what does the plumber do? The plumber repairs taps and shovel. Doctor. Doctor treats sick people. So when we are sick, to whom do we go? We go to a doctor, is it? So he treats the sick people and give medicines, is it? So the doctor is a person who treats sick people. Okay, so the doctor treats, he cures the sick people by giving medicines. And the next is carpenter. So how does the carpenter help us? Makes Furniture. So the carpenter makes furniture for like the table, dust, chair, doors, windows. All these things are done by a carpenter. So how does the carpenter help us? The carpenter makes furniture. Okay. And next, barber. So how does the barber help us? When your hairs are grown long, to whom do you go? You won't cut it by yourself? Whether you cut your hair by yourself? No. We go to a barber shop. Is it? So, who does the cut the hair? Barber. Barber cuts hair. Okay. How does the barber? 
the shoe okay so the cobbler mends shoes or slippers and polish shoes next is sweeper how the sweeper will help us sweeper keeps surrounding clean okay the sweeper sweeps the surrounding sweep the area okay so the sweeper keeps the surrounding clean by sweeping okay so the sweeper keeps surrounding clean the next is grocer so who is a grocer grocer sells fruits and vegetables okay the grocer sells fruits and vegetables so these are some of the helpers like this we have many helpers like this okay for example who builds the house the mason is it and when there is uh, something uh, problem in our bulbs who does the who does the electrical work we call him as a electrician okay so like this like this we depend upon many helpers in our daily life to make our life easy and comfortable to make our work easy and comfortable is it not so children we can't do all these works by ourselves is it so it is not possible for us to do all the works by ourselves okay so we depend upon others we call the mass helpers okay so this is their occupation okay so they do these services to earn money okay so all these helpers do these services to earn money so as i told you before a job done by a person to earn money so this job is called as occupation okay a job done by a person to earn money okay so we all believe these helpers does this work to earn money so that is their job so this job okay, a job done by a person to earn money is called occupation okay so like this we depend upon many of the helpers to make our work easy and comfortable okay children so these are some of the helpers who help us like tailor teacher policeman postman carpenter sweeper plumber okay doctor so these are some of the helpers who help us in our daily life to make our work easy and comfortable okay children so now it's all the time to end the session i'm going to end the session now we will continue the, the same lesson in the next class we'll do a recap we'll continue writing the textbook exercise okay children thank you